you tired of your crappy first curse? Probably not, because you probably haven't been using it and probably forgot it existed and it's been collecting dust in your vault. Well, today I'm going to show you that that pile of dust can become the new meta. In order to pull off this glitch, you're going to need the seal to Hamkar grass. I'll show why that's important in a minute here soon. In order for you to start this glitch, you're going to need to get a precision kill with the first curse. This is a bigger task than you might think it is, but to be honest, the first curse is actually much better since the new update. Once you have acquired a new magazine filled with the first curse perk on, you're going to want to simply switch to another weapon when your ammo gets low. Once you have a different weapon equipped, this is where the Seal to Hamkar grass come in. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to try to do melee damage in order to cause the first curse to be refilled with primary ammo, but you don't want to have it equipped. As you'll be able to see, when you're doing melee damage with the first curse equipped, it actually takes off the first curse perk. You're going to want to be using the Incendiary Blade because it almost guarantees that you'll have enough procs with melee damage to give you a full refilled magazine. Now before you ask me, smoke grenades do not work with the seal to Hamkar grass. They just don't and I don't understand why. Now I took the liberty of asking myself the question, why exactly does this work? Well, triple tap is on the first curse, and since the first curse perk reactivates and fills the ammo in the magazine, it essentially means that more bullets can be added to that magazine with the perk staying on. That's why the Seal the Hamkar Grass are capable of refilling the magazine. But, when you have it equipped, it counts it as a reload, and as such would simply cancel that effect. But when you have it not equipped, the game registers it as just simply bullets being added to your magazine, similar to that of when you pick up heavy ammo from a, from a heavy box, and it automatically refills the heavy ammo. It simply is just programming that Bungie didn't really think all the way through. And if you're wondering, yes, the bullets actually do work properly. And with that said, you are ready to perform this glitch for yourself. It's very easy to do, and I hope this actually might become something that could be meta-worthy. But regardless, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.